What's up everybody, Takedown here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be sharing something with you that I never thought was going to be on my channel. And it is a video about politics. Now, as you guys know, I live in Canada. I live in Ontario. So this is something that interests me. That's why I wanted to share it with you guys. Some people are for it. Some people are against it. So I just wanted to share it and share my opinion on the situation. So recently, Doug Ford announced he's going to be planning on cutting Toronto City Council in half. Doug Ford is Ontario's premier, so he does have the right to do it. He plans on cutting the council in half from 47 down to 25 seats, which is a big cut. It's something that, in my opinion, has never really been done before. By doing this, he will be saving taxpayers $25 million in the city of Toronto, which is a lot of money. Like I said, he does have the right to do it since he is Ontario's premier and a lot of people are trying to fight it. A lot of people in Toronto are bickering right after the announcement came because if you're on the receiving end of a big cut like this, that's like saying you have a 50-50% chance of losing your job. So obviously you're going to try to defend yourself and you're going to try to make this not happen. I do understand that, but in the same sense, he is Ontario's premier he does have the right to change any municipality in Ontario if he so wishes. The other cities in Ontario are now scared, thinking he will do the same. A lot of people thought he will be coming for Ottawa next, and that is just not the case. Which, it is kind of funny because Ottawa's mayor is now against the cuts. He does not think in 2018 we should be cutting council staff. Back then, whenever he was running for Ottawa mayor, he wanted to cut Ottawa staff not in half, but from 25 down to 17, which is a mild cut, but because he was only running for mayor, he had to get approved from everybody at City Hall and nobody approved it. So he wanted to make the cuts back then, but now in 2018, when Doug Ford, somebody that has the power to make these cuts, he doesn't think they should be allowed to, which to me doesn't make sense because you were just gonna do it years ago. You just were outvoted because you were not able to do it because you did not have the power to do it. So it is pretty interesting. In my opinion, honestly, I would say go ahead and cut them. Toronto is Canada's biggest city, but if it's gonna save Toronto $25 million, I think it is for the better. But that is just my opinion. I wanna see what you guys think. Comment down below what your opinions are of this. Are you for or against this decision that Doug Ford is gonna be doing? He doesn't plan on cutting it until October, back whenever the elections happen, but Toronto says they're gonna be fighting it in the meantime, which is something I don't think they can legally do. I don't think they understand that he has the power to make these changes, so if he does go through with it, it's going to happen. There's nothing they can really do about it. But I wanna see what you guys think. Comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.